So this is actually going to be the last part of my collection video for this year. I know I didn't do, I don't think I did like foundations and stuff, but I don't have that many of them. They're not really that interesting. At least I don't think they are. And I'd already decluttered all of them, so I don't really need to go through all them. So uh, yeah, this is going to be the last part of my collection video for this year. Um, so I'm going to start with this, which I haven't taken out of the box properly. This is from Australis. This is a glitter lip kit. This is kind of like the um, super expensive one, Ray Morris. Ray Morrison? Ray Morris one. This is in purple. And basically what comes in this kit is this lip bond stuff, which is actually clear. And then it has... Um, a glitter oops, in the bottom here. I've obviously had trouble getting into this before because it's broken. Um, so it's just basically purple glitter to stick on with the lip bond. So, yeah. Um, this is all liquid lipsticks and some lip glosses that got missed in the lip gloss video because they were in a different section of like because the box is not super duper organized <laughs> so i'm trying to get it reorganized but it's not being very successful so this is another one of the little chi chi ones that i showed in the last one this is just a different color i think there's another one hiding somewhere as well just mini lip glosses. Really need to start working on them. Um, I have this lip gloss from Maybelline. This one is in Mirrored Plum. This is one of my favourite lip glosses. I just really like that, that shade. Um, this is also a lip gloss. This is from Haughty Cosmetics. Came in a lip monthly. This is in the shade Give. It's just a red. Just a red. Um, this one from LA Colors. This is called Seduce. And basically it's just purple glitter. <laughs> I was seduced because, you know, purple glitter. Um, I think... I think all the rest are supposed to be liquid lipsticks. Technically. Oh, these... these are, they're, they're not really, but... Um, okay. This one is from Beauty For Real. This is called Kiss Me. Um, I believe, yeah, this one is just a lip gloss. All the rest of them should be liquid lipstick type things with lacquer type of do flickies. Um, yeah. This one's from Lip Fusion. Um, I showed you my bronzers, one from Glow Fusion. It's the same people. This is supposed to be a lip plumping one. Um, again, it's actually gloss. Jeez. Should be it for the lip glosses. Everything else should be a liquid lipstick or similar. Not all of them are mattes, obviously. So this one is from La Cura Beauty. It actually has a lip gloss on one end and then it has one of them long lasting type lip colours on the other end. Uh, 
Does it have a name? Nope. Oh, yes, it does. Fancy Plum. Okay, so that's that one. Um, there's so many to choose from. I don't know where to start. Uh, this one is from Chi Chi. This is called Dramatic Lip Lacquer. This is in Fashion Police. Been a while since I've swatched that one. Uh, another Lacura one. This one is again nameless. Look at the weirdest looking doe foot applicator. Hmm, interesting. Um, I bought it and then didn't do anything with it. You know how you do that when you've got so much stuff. My one and only ColourPop. This is Fresh Cut. Which is an ultra matte. Not a bad color, actually. Uh, L'Oreal uh, High Intensity Pigment Liquid Lipstick. These, this is old style liquid lipstick. <laughs> this is in Harmless. Hmm, pretty. Looks more like lip gloss, though. I tell you. Um, this is a CoverGirl Two Step One. Well, it still smells the same as it always did. That is a great colour. That is in 250. I don't know what colour that is. It doesn't have a name. Um, and it has a clear lip gloss on the end of it. Um, I have a Rimmel Provocalypse. This is in Dare to Pink, which is not the best colour choice for me. It's a little bit too light. I bought it because... Um, Cat from Beauty and Ease recommended it. Um, I have an Apocalypse from Rimmel in Celestial. I'm trying to get into new lipsticks and then I never wear them. Because I have so many other options. I have this one from Santi Shop Miss A. This is number 11. But can you guess why I bought it? Purple. Uh, I got this one from Australis. This is one of their Velour Matte Lip Creams. This is in Shanghai. Got fluff on my finger. Look at that color. Beautiful. Um, a NYX Lingerie in Embellishment. Which was the only colour out of the original release that I actually liked the colour of. Because it's got a slight rosiness to it. Another one from Santi. This one is sparkly. And this is number 23. Again, no names. But super pretty. Uh, what else do we have here? We have a Be A Bombshell one in, ah, oh, this is supposed to be a lip gloss. This is in Hook. Oh, not bad. Um, this is another Santee one. This one is pink, though. Like, bright-ass pink. Uh, a NYX... Cosmic Metals. This one is in Asteroid Aura. I love this lipstick. It's beautiful. It's great color. Ofra in Mina. I got all of my Ofra lipsticks, lip glosses through um, Lip Monthly. So that one's like a really dark one. And then I have Laguna Beach which is a nude and I also have uh, New Orleans, the lip break. So those are my Ofra ones. I have another Velour Lips. This is in my Ami. Uh, 
Vaseline lip lacquer thing. This is in Move Mystique. These are more like lip glosses, even though they call themselves lip lacquers. I also have it in Vision in Violet. Can you guess why I bought that one? couple of fake lip tars. So I have this red one and an orange one. These are by BYS. They are in the Big Apple and Bar Barbados Bikini. And then I have some real, I have a couple of real lip tars. Three of them, in fact. I have Memento, NSFW, and anime. I did have another one, but its packaging was broken and it was disgusting. Now I am going to clean off my hand. And you can see which ones stick well. And funnily enough, it's usually the really cheap ones that stick really well to me. No, a bit red, but anyway, no worries. Okay, another one from Shop Miss A. Uh, again, this doesn't have a name. Um, I love the packaging. It comes in a wine bottle. Not that I drink, but the fact that it's wine coloured in a wine bottle appeals to me. Uh, I have this Milani Lip Intense Liquid Lip. This one is in Violet Addict, which is a freaking awesome colour. Freaking awesome. Revlon Metallic HD Lipstick. I paid a bit for this. Um, this is in HD Glitz um, because it was the only colour that I liked because it was the only odd one and all the rest were like really normal colours. Uh, Milani Power Lip in Pink Lemonade. This is one of those ones that you squeeze up. It's bright pink. Um, another Astral. This is one, is one of their liquid lips. This is in Pavlova. As in Pavlova, but Pavlova. Which is a great colour. Then I have... Three of the glazed lip colours from LA Colours. I have Pin Up, Koi, and Blushing. They're like the, what are they, Too Faced Melted Lips. I like those. But they're not. They just like them. Uh, a NYX Butter Gloss. This one is in Angel Food Cake. And then we are down to the last of them. So I got the uh, Kat Von D lip fold thing when I got my metal matte uh, palette thing, um, which came with eight minis of her lip colours. So I have Santa Sangri Echo Roxy Lovesick Plath uh, Backstage Bambi Mother and L U V. Um, I don't really support her anymore, so I'm not going to swatch those on my channel or anything. Sorry if you wanted to see them. Um, um, yeah. And I got the NYX Matte, Lay Matte uh, Liquid Suede um, Lip Vault thing. And I got it for a ridiculously good price in Australia. It was less than half price. And I, then I got it on a gift card. So I really didn't pay very much for it at all. <laughs> oh, but these are some of the coolest lip colours out there. Um, 
so we have fold again, which is an orange, which is really not that interesting. Um, and then we have Orange County, which on the other hand, I mean, I really like orange lipstick, so for me that is perfect. Um, there's Soft Spoken, which is a great standard kind of deep neutral, if you like, neutral lips. This one is a weird ass colour. This is called Downtown Beauty. And it's kind of poop coloured. It's very strange. Very strange. Uh, standard pink one in respect to the pink. This one is a nude. This is tea and cookies. This is like a very standard nude. Um, then there's Sandstorm, which is another weird brown colour. It seems to like brown. I do a lot of them. Um, this one is Stone Fox, which I really like. It's like a greeny grey. And then we have Vintage, which is another colour that I really like. It's because it's not as brown, it's kind of got more red to it. Uh, Life's a Beach is like a peachy pink. Uh, Amethyst, my birthstone. Of course I'm going to like that one. Uh, uh, Club Hopper, which is like a vampy brown. This has got a bit of red in that one, unlike the poopy one, which is just weird. <laughs> Jet Set, which is almost a blurple. I like. Um, this one is Alien, which I love that one. It's so cool because it's unusual. I like unusual colors. Um, I'm currently um, panning um, Little Denim Dress, which is a light blue. This is Run the World, which is just a purple. Uh, pink Lust, bright pink. There's a couple of reds, there's Kitten Heels, which is standard bright red, and then there's um, Cherry Skies, which is more of a dark red. There's Sway, which is a pastel purple. Um, there is Oh Put It On. Is this awesome blackened purple? Then we have Subversive Socialite, which is another purple, and Foul Mouth, which is another purple, but it's more of a grey purple. And lastly, because I don't have little damn dress near me. We have Brooklyn Thorn, which is another brown kind of colour. But it's more greyed out, so it's not quite so bad. Yeah, so those are all of my liquid lipsticks and the last of my lip glosses and my lip tars and all of that kind of stuff. So that is it for this makeup collection uh, series. Uh, if you want to subscribe to my channel, click down there, click the bell if you want to get notified of when I upload new videos, leave me a thumbs up if you like makeup type videos, and leave me a comment down below, I try to respond to all comments, and I will see you in the next video. See ya!